I'm gonna give you two names, one that you're gonna probably recognize, one you may have heard of. One is the name of Peyton Manning, which everybody knows. He's gonna be a future Hall of Famer. And the other one, his name is Ryan Leaf, and he is a future Hall of Shamer. Many people may not know who Ryan Leaf is, but when Ryan Leaf came out of college, he came out the same year as Peyton Manning. And Peyton finished second in the Heisman voting, Ryan finished third. And there were many teams that felt that they should choose Ryan Leaf ahead of Peyton Manning in the draft. And yet the Colts, at the end of the day, decided, nope, we're gonna go with Peyton Manning. And number two, who was the choice? Well, it was Ryan Leaf. Ryan Leaf won his first two games as a starter. He won two more games his entire NFL career. And Peyton Manning, well, you all know the story of Peyton Manning and where he is. Once again, Peyton Manning is a future Hall of Famer. He has finished strong in his career. And Ryan Leaf, unfortunately, through making poor choices, has struggled mightily. In fact, he has struggled to the point where you may not even know his name, and he's struggled to the point where he's ended up in jail, he's been in and out of jail, and he's had struggle after struggle after struggle. Why? Well, we believe it's because of the choices that he made, the decisions that he made that were outside of God. If your desire is to be a future Hall of Famer when it comes to God's eyes, what is it that you will choose? I'm going to share with you that type of person that you want to choose and have in your life for tomorrow. But tonight, would you pray and see where you're at as far as your walk to the Hall of Fame in God's eyes? And we'll see you tomorrow.